to be able to pull back, just pull back with a simple pull back that you know is coming, and this man got you with your ass air man pause it's just it's just that's bad bro like like why? why why is this like this this dude did a simple pullback and he got my man toaster with his ass in the air man why hey guys it's lj make sure you like the video and subscribe for more great content from my daddy good morning out there in 2k land man check this out man let me tell y'all something regardless of how you feel about kai man this is one of the dopest things i've ever seen man he's out there with adam silver man that dude is dressed to the nines got that hair fried dyed laid to the side man and like this is like something for all content creators man like he got he literally said hey man he Adam Silver knows who you are. Obviously, he does you in the NBA commercial, man. And then what happens? He's he's shaking his hand, and then he Adam Silver is actually cool. And I think Adam Silver like six five also. And he's like, hey, he's like, just say, can you say, you know, with the first pick, uh, you know, we we got. Matter of fact, matter of fact, we gonna we gonna let we gonna let y'all hear what what he's saying. It's the first pick. Select Kai. Hey, you can really hear it. That's why I didn't even really do it like that, man. But he just said with the first pick of the 2025 draft, the New York Knicks select Kai Sinny. Hey, man, point guard. But hey, this dude right here that shows you what you can do, man. If you go out there and get after it and you got the, you got the, you know what I'm saying? You got the right people behind you, man. You can really go get it too, man. That's super dope right there, man. So big shout out to Kai, man. And also uh, with accomplishments. Hey, man, we saw the King suit up with his son, man. This is one of the greatest things in ever. Like, my daddy worked with my sisters at the job. You know, people work with their dads at the job, man. This is emotional. Are you tripping or whatever, man? Like, it's like, dudes, dudes, we were like, look, look, say, hey, if you didn't get emotional watching Bronny check into the game, a Lakers game with his dad, uh, LeBron, you, you, you might want to check your post, man. And man, let me tell you something, man. You might want to check that post. Dudes say emotional. Bro, like, hey, I, I know people be funny, man. They say, dude, for one second, uh, dude, for one second, yes, but Bronny James doesn't deserve to be. Bro, he do deserve to be in the league. Let's see what my boy Base God said, man. Base God said, yeah, it was emotional thinking about the opportunity taken away from a kid. Bro, what are y'all talking about, bro? Dudes would be like emotional, bro. If you ain't, I, tell me you ain't got no kids without telling me you ain't got no kids. Or tell me you can't do nothing for your children without telling me that you can't do nothing for your children. Look, man. Hey, a lot of people dream about stuff like that, man. Like, like, just think about that. Like, like being able to do put your child in a position and just thinking about, like, like even look at even right here with Sam, uh, with with Sam Mitchell and his daughter. Five years ago, I got to work opening night in Toronto with my dad. You think people don't dream about? Hey, hold on, hold on one second, because you know bridging up. Damn. 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 Shit. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. Put the put the thumbs up in the chat if you understand what I'm trying to tell y'all, man. But look at that, man. Hey, say I got to work with my dad opening day. This is Morgan Mitchell. You think people don't dream about following in their parents' footsteps and doing what they do? The only reason that I only know how to work is because all my daddy did was work. That's all I see him do is work. It was I was either gonna be an educator or I was gonna work. At, 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 at the power plant or wherever with my dad. Like that's how it was. Both of my sisters ended up working at the power plant. I went into IT. It, it wasn't it wasn't big enough back then for me to work there. But people dream about following in their people's footsteps and putting their children in positions to to do stuff. So if you got children and you want to be able to elevate your child, that's why I would have been emotional. If you don't care about your children and you don't take care of your children and you don't and you and you you still really really don't give a single solitary mother about your chi your kids or something like that, it makes sense because some people don't want to see anybody doing better than them or as well as them or any of that, even their own children. And that's insane to me. But check this out, man. We ain't gonna worry about that, man. Like the haters can hate and whatever. I got a little emotion. I even threw the me and Brute was playing, me, Brute and Gambit. We almost threw the game trying to just look at that part where Bronny James was coming. They were like, damn, Bronny, check it in. Hold on, we gotta look at this because this is history. And so, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I got a son. If I was able to bring him on where I work, we got some father and son teams here at, at, at a lot of the companies that I do IT for. And you think that those dads don't get him, bro, you can see it on their face. They love having their sons, their executives at these companies, and they bringing their son in who just got out of college at an executive level, and he's trying to learn the game just like them. And you think he does? They they deserve to be there. You damn right, he deserve to be there because his dad is there and he runs the whole thing. So that's the same. What's the difference between that and LeBron, man? It doesn't matter. He can figure it out. He can get there. And if he doesn't, oh the f well, because what? 
it is what it is. It ain't hurt nobody, so hey, whatever. But anyway, and if somebody was better than him, they'll be there. Like they're gonna get playing time. Look, connect there. He got playing time. The other, you know what I'm saying? It, it is what it is. I can go about all that anyway. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video, comment y'all thoughts down below. Y'all already know we're trying to go with this thing. Tell them all dollars. And if nobody told y'all this today, y'all my brothers, my sisters, my family. I love each and every last one of y'all, man. We're gonna put that segment probably on my other channel, uh, whatever, man. But look, man, this is what we're here to talk about. That boy Mike Wongman tweets, hey, hey. That boy Mike Wongman tweets, hey, 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 hey. And this is what he said, man, Baluba. If y'all don't know this, I was watching that boy Quavius Young stream last uh, yesterday morning, and they had about 15 update requirements or whatever, and they was tweaking some stuff, man. And while they was tweaking and, tw and getting it done, this is what Mike Wong said. Hey, this morning, the gameplay team released a hot fix to update PS5, Xbox Series X, and PC that made a slight buff to interior defense and perimeter contest system based on the community feedback and uh, game, te game telemetry data. Uh, please return to the main menu to ensure that you have the you have the latest updates. We will continue to monitor the feedback and analyze shooting statistics over the next several days and make additional tweaks as necessary to fine tune the balance. And that's one thing I like because this can be done with the hot fix. The contest logic can be updated or changed or whatever with a hot fix. That means that we can just do it with an update required. We don't have to sit there and wait on the next patch or whatever. So maybe they patched in the ability to tweak it or whatever. I think it's dope, man. Man, he says, hey, he said, nah, nice cap. Interior defense is still horrid. I'm not going to lie. I noticed, this is me. I have noticed a market improvement in interior defense. The only issue is people still can with, it, 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 this is, and it's a major issue. People can still back you down and drop step you. But if you've got similar strength, similar size and all that, they can try, but it's not as easy or whatever. And dude said, hey, please, please fix uh wreck exit button yeah they definitely need to do that man it says, it says so hands up is back to being viable uh for contest uh that is a resounding no nah. nah you know hands up ain't back to viable contest and he said hey, what about our records but well, nobody care about that w man let me say now just revert the shooting buff back to how it was i liked it when i, I when my 55 percent is stood out or whatever man now everybody is shooting the skin off the ball that's just how it goes man but look that boy dev Khan, he said uh this is my guy right here man he said this is a w bro i gotta start doing that but w interior defense man that's what i'm saying like like some people are saying that interior defense don't work but if you've got the right like for the brain dead stuff it works i think that's the only thing that anybody really ever cared about the brain dead stuff you used to just be able to go straight up with that and it didn't matter and, and, and stuff like that was going in. Now you at least have a chance. If they back you down into the paint and drop step you and do all this stuff, you're still dead. You're still barbecue chicken. You're still dead as fried fried fish. That's what it is. But at least now you have a chance. Did he just wave to him and then shoot that tray ball? Tray ball, bang, bang, bang. Like, hey, get him out of here, man. Like I said, we don't care about getting a stop every single time. We just want to make it harder and I'll pause and then we just want to have a chance at it man and i think that that's what they have done on that but i like i said with the right badges and stuff i noticed the market improvement uh last week i mean last week when they first did it man so you know uh it, it just is what it is man up next hey we got we got uh we got what do we got right here man hold on that was the wrong thing right there that was that was uh, what's the name they asked oh, here we go then we, the people are asking 2k25 is better after the patch a lot of people said 100 percent. look i don't think it's better after the patch i really don't i'm gonna be honest with y'all i really don't rock with the gameplay after the patch. I rock with the game but how the game must be played after the patch i really don't rock with that but i'm still gonna play it i'm still gonna enjoy it i'm still gonna beat the dog shit out of most of the, most of the people that we play so it is what it is we was out there playing super toxic now look look since you gotta jump at everything you might as well load up in the park with two with two heavy heavy ass centers one of them six I mean, we got one one i'm six nine brute is uh seven foot and all we doing is brute go to the corner we play sides i jump at uh gambit jumps at everything and then me and brute go rebound and then on offense we're gonna get every offensive rebound and then me and brute can shoot so it just is what it is bro so like i i, I made a new build i'm gonna drop that video today uh for y'all man uh this is the best corner build i'm gonna come up with the park center build pretty soon but i gotta see what the meta goes to man but like we said a lot of people said hey dude i, I, I can't speak uh speak french or whatever man say it said bold face lie <laughs> yeah i agree with that it said just want sbmm gone but 
but uh but yeah it's better like I, I don't i feel like it's better like like my dog big dog banner said a couple uh, a couple days ago he said hey man pay attention to who likes this pass and who doesn't and that's gonna tell you who's good and who's not now for the things like the better interior defense i don't know why you would make interior defense better but make the thing that really counts perimeter defense m you got to jump at everything like that makes no sense to me i think that they're gonna see the error of their ways there pretty soon and they will make a change there but my boy c six seven said hey man i think i figured out what mike Wong, why mike Wong changed uh the shooting and we'll be and we'll be able to explain uh explain it to everyone in terms of uh of a person who plays the game instead of just a mumbo jumbo bs that <laughs> that we get in the patch notes uh or just a typical they fix shooting i will try to explain it tomorrow so uh we haven't gotten that from sid yet man i think i know why they changed shooting though they don't want people to help i'm gonna tell you like that people in this game they really hate zone and um they really hate zone they really hate any type of organization organizational team team organization they come out there to see the team playing zone they mad they don't want to do uh to do something man they, they just don't want to deal with it man so that's tough man we're gonna take a quick mental health minute minute man for my guy uh two times man i mean tea time he just said listen man hey i suffer from ptsd and yes some days uh it gets the best of me but i try not to let it define me and this is not a pity uh this is not a pity party stuff uh just a reminder that it's okay to not be okay and to me and then cold the man came man and said he said i like this i like this a lot not letting it become who uh who you are or personality trait too many uh too many let it consume them instead of focusing on the good in life the only only counter to that is i'm telling you man look i suffer from i i know i got cte i know i have that because I played football pretty much my whole life and I took a lot of, uh, uh, you know, just blows to the head. Pause, there's no way, the easy way to say that. So I know I got some form of CTE and it does impact my personality. And some days are better than others. And the only problem is, like he said, don't not letting it consume you and become a personality trait. But sometimes, man, when, when you are depressed and when you are down in the dumps, and things are not going your way you cannot see past the moment it's hard because you have to rely on what you know i know that, my, that lj and bridget and my family love me so i can lean on that but some people do not have that they don't have anything that they actually know that they can lean on so having something that you know that you can lean on is very fortunate in our cases you know but some people just don't have that man and i feel and my heart goes out to the people that don't have that but it's okay to not be okay if you got to get some help get some help lean on the people that you can lean on man and that's what we got to do man so that's the mental health moment for the day man hey hey just just know that you're not alone that's all we got for you on that one man up next we got hey we got my boy trying to tell oh this was yesterday though he's like this is ways you can get jersey for free you can go you obviously you can go buy them and stuff like that you can do jersey swaps you can do heart of the dynasty and all that and uh if you order if you order an all-star edition you already got the jason tatum jersey in your inventory though my boy all city big heck always trying to help us out help us out with some stuff right there man uh he, he's already He's, you know, one of the biggest contributors to the show, man. Hey, Hanky the Tanky said, if I'm, if I'm, uh, I don't know if I'm tripping, but skill based batch making looks like he's fixing the park. Can, I, can anybody confirm? I would definitely say it does appear to be. He said, Parker, you joking? <laughs> Isn't that walk up and stand on the dot shaking my head, which means, uh, which mean in park? Oh, I guess he's trying to say, what do you mean about park? Anybody of uh, any skills set can pull up. This, this is what, this is what y'all don't understand. So this like, tell me that you're not, high high skill level without telling me that you're not high skill level when you go when you got a one of these plates right here that that uh this this joint right here this purple plate or red plate when it used to be when we went in the parks that's all we played was purple plates or red plates that was it that's it that is it hey tell me tell me that the talladega knights man telling my inner wheel pharaoh but like that was it so every game was game seven of the finals every game we were playing against the, the heavy lock with the heavy with a tall center and at a shifty point guard that's what we were doing every single game and now we we, we playing against regular people in the park so if you didn't notice that you're one of the regular people in the park it, it just is what it is i'm sorry but like we will go in the park and you see a 15 game winning streak everybody's on the winning streak like every court is on fire 10 games plus and and you got to choose you got to pick your poison it's like choose your fighter like that's what you had to do man so it's all good like but if you didn't notice it that means the skill based matching matchmaking was doing its job so you're being protected in your protected queue and that's how it should be man up next hey uh uh all city big heck said does rebounding rating help 
uh, with picking up the loose ball on defense. And he says uh, it's the hands attribute, which is which is tied to the ball handle, which is which is why guards pick up the ball, uh, pick up their own plucks, and why if you get plucked by a PG, he's uh, get he gets it more often. He said, Baloo, maybe you can provide some more insight on this right here. I don't know what it's tied to because because sometimes uh like brute got high ball handling and when he plucks somebody or something like that it, the same thing happens but at the same time he might be right it might be hands and it might be tied to ball handling and uh that might be it if anybody knows let us know man hey that man said 2k leaks and then that people are saying that 2k 25 is unplayable after the patch facts are cap it is almost unplayable but it's definitely unplayable with people of dissimilar skill level let me say that again it is very unplayable with people of this similar skill level so if you're playing with somebody and you're playing over their head it's you're gonna have a terrible time and you'll be you'll be surprised if you win games and stuff like that say people saying cap uh cap or corner oh, let me see is it facts or cap it is fact I, I think it's almost unplayable he said people people saying cap are either corner sitters uh that shoot with square there is corner sitters shoot with square there's no way that you sit here with, with confidence saying that the game is better after the patch nonsense contests make no sense they somehow make rhythm shooting more made rhythm shooting more difficult and rng ankle breakers are terrible he says no no contest system at all and they nerf steal so much it's unplayable just frustrating the games it can beyond belief now and he said we on blackout sticks instead bro dang that's tough right there but yeah it is almost unplayable and if you don't believe it then if you don't believe me talk to mr isolation man mr isolation said hey recent patch ruined rhythm shooting and uh and nba 2k 25 overall the game was better before uh they before they buffed square shooting but left the contest system non-existent so everyone just jacks mindless shots until they drop the defense does not matter it's unplayable and he said hey he said shoot don't even feel like 2k anymore just 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 remaster uh 2k19 and a smile again so like i said man like this is one of those things where i'm telling y'all if you play the game on a certain level and if you expect things to make sense it don't don't do that because that's that's where we are right now and like i said pay attention to who like it and who don't because it's gonna tell you a lot that boy tj my boy says shout out to my community uh you know for all the support but i want to give a big shout out to 2k logo been waiting for a minute for it and i finally got it let's lock in man hey man some people don't care about the logo but he does if he does and he got it then hey that's what it is i'm happy for him because that's my guy man go get your Go get everything that you deserve to get, man. Now that boy all see the big heck, man. My guy Coaster says, look, I'm telling you that 99 perimeter defense will change your life. He's telling you that he has 99 perimeter defense. So I don't want to hear nobody in here saying, <laughs> if you got no perimeter defense, you should get the Shut the f up. Shut the f up. Me, me and Gambit, I got 97 perimeter. Gambit got 99 perimeter. And this weak ass move drops you every single time, bro. It does not matter. They pull back. You can't get up. He didn't just get dropped. He got dropped and rolled. It really looks like Jeff McGinnis right here and uh and Randolph Childress. Like he just a simple step back and he can't Damn. get. Damn. Damn. Shit. He can't get up after a simple step back. This is it. A simple step back that he didn't even go for. Look at this. It's a step back that he didn't even go for. And and it's absolutely insane, man. So hey, it is what it is, man. We're gonna leave him right there touching earth. Uh right. Yeah, man. That man got it. That man got it. Yeah, man. That man. It's, it's no way that pause, and I'm pausing before I say this, but it's no way that somebody should be able to pull back, just pull back with a simple pull back that you know is coming. And this man got you with your ass in the air, man. Pause. It's just, it's just, that's bad, bro. Like, like, why? Why, why is this like this? This dude did a simple pull back and he got my man Coaster with his ass in the air, man. Why? Why 2K? Why? I don't know why they did that, man. It is what it is, man. But like, they gotta stop that, man. That's too crazy, man. My boy, my boy Fleezer says, "Hey, no shot contest, no paint defense, just vibes." That's where we at with it, man. He said perimeter and interior uh, contest got even worse after the patch. How the world did they make it worse? Beluga gameplay devs or uh, or something else? Clear house, get some get some new minds behind design. Hall of Fame paint controller was solid AF before the patch. Now it's not worth anything. Now I think that they, I think it really is because, like I said, I, 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 we got Gambit in the paint. So 
so I, I probably got different experience than a lot of people, but you know, it, it's just as how it goes. Said rhythm shooting don't feel the same, or am I tripping? No, it does not feel the same. It's it's dang near on release now. So where you used to be able to put the uh put it where you wanted to with the jump shot, now it seems like everything that you rhythm shoot is uh, on release. So you might have to tune your jump shot a little bit, but that's what I have noticed on that, man. They said, hey man, what does workhorse do? Uh, where they workhorse? And this is more or less what they was trying to say, man, where there's like, like you get the pluck, he gets plucked, get it right back, get another pluck, get it right back, get another pluck, get it right back. Now you are just spam reaching, I ain't gonna lie, but I mean like, like you, I don't know how you're supposed to get the ball with your back turned to it. So so I can't really have no sympathy for you on that one. But I do understand that sometimes people do that and then they sprint to the ball, turn around and get it done. So so that's how it goes, man. Hey, my man said we almost lost the overnight on this right here, man. The man said set the off ball slip, do this right here. Now nah, we don't care about none of that. So they score right here. Boom. It was one second left, right? He scores, boom, with the dunk. You take the lead, right? Now, 0.2 seconds left. I don't even understand how that's the case. Watch this right here. Like, this is just where the game game is, is absolutely insane. He blew, look at that. He tips the ball in with 0.2 left. The only thing you can do with 0.2 is tip it toward the rim. So they got that part right. This is X'd out. So I don't know how that is, how that happened right there. We, know, we already know we play good defense. It's good. The ball goes into the air. It gets tipped in tie game they go to overtime and you know he's like what in the actual world happened right there man like i said man this is the stuff that you only see in uh in 2k man like i said bro it, it and then and last but not least we're gonna talk about what my guy don works is talking about right here and they just saying say we're about two months into the game give me the latest thoughts on my career anything anything you like whatever whatever and so you know don work is the my career savant he says hey i always thought that that uh there should be specific rewards for players who complete the season and win championships on hall of fame difficulty whether it be cosmetic big vc bonus uh you know or both so like you know like that's what they say man i don't know man i'm not really I, I do play my career but i don't play enough of it to really worry about the rewards in my career so we'll see how that goes man but y'all let me know what y'all think will make my career better what, what do y'all think do y'all think the game is better or worse after the patch and like do y'all think that um y'all think that, that the game needs more work if it is a work in progress and they are constantly tuning it i'm not mad at it let's rock with it and we can just make updates with the data but we can't just look at the data mike you can't just look at the data we got to look at the gameplay and what what it turns into and i know that you have to see that that right now the data but you got a piece of linen in your locks man it just, it just really breaks your whole day up but it, we have to see what is actually going on getting in some streams not saying that you're not but let's get in some streams look at some gameplay and let's see what's actually going on how the data is manifesting itself in gameplay because it's making it very tough on a lot of people man like it's just making it hard to play i would like to see hands up defense come back but i mean you just gotta be there like more like it was day one and i don't know if y'all can do that but you can't take pretty much take contests out of the game and then make contested shots easier by buffing open shots and then think that it's just gonna be it's gonna work out man it just don't work like that man but y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section uh hopefully y'all enjoyed the video like the video subscribe if you know i'll holler at y'all next time till next time it's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Guys, please, guys, please.